Hey guys, it's Sarah. I'm back with day four of cocktail week. If you tuned in yesterday, you would have seen a really quick and easy cocktail, the Americano Highball. And we're using two of the same ingredients today. We're making one of my absolute favorite drinks. This is a Boulevardier. So this is a stirred drink. It is kind of like a riff on a Negroni again. You've got your Campari, you've got your sweet vermouth, but instead of gin, you use rye whiskey. Can you use bourbon whiskey as well? Yes. My off-screen cocktail expert says yes. So you have your Campari, you have your sweet vermouth, and instead of gin, you can use rye whiskey or bourbon whiskey. Don't at me if I'm wrong. It's whiskey, okay? Take a chill pill. So it's basically very simple, equal parts of each. You stir it together till it's nice and cold and then you drink it. So that's one of the reasons I like this drink, but mainly it is so delicious, so yummy, so full of flavor. And for me, a cocktail has to be strong. I hate those like sweet, watered down things. It needs to taste like it's a cocktail and it needs to do its job like it's a cocktail and this one definitely does. So I've got my Yarai, my mixing glass, and I'm gonna get some ice in there. I've got a lot of ice in here, but unlike the martini, I'm not gonna stir this for a long time because you can serve the Boulevardia two ways. You can serve it in a rocks glass on ice, which is what I'm gonna do, which makes it really nice and refreshing. It's a nice sipping drip. Drip? <laughs> What's a drip? <laughs> Terrible. All right, day four of cocktail week. Woo! Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Got something about drip. <sighs> so I've got a lot of ice in my mixing glass, but I'm not going to stir this for a long time like I did my martini on day one of cocktail week, if we can toss our minds back. Instead, it goes for a short while, and then I'm serving mine in a rocks glass, on a rock, which is ice. Um, that makes it really refreshing and easy to sip. But you can also stir it like a martini and then serve it in one of those pretty coupe glasses. That works very well as well. Either way, you're gonna get a Boulevardier out of it. And that is a good situation to be in. So we're gonna do one ounce each of whiskey, Campari and sweet vermouth. After adding one ounce of whiskey, we're gonna add the same amount of Campari, which as you should know by now, if you've been following along, is a beautiful Italian herbal bittersweet liqueur. One ounce of sweet vermouth. And now we stir. Get a nice big piece of ice in your rocks glass and pour it over as a garnish a nice piece of orange zest which I did not get that time so you just want to grab the orange zest like that with the outside side facing away from you and then just fold it in your fingers and you'll get those beautiful essential oils coming out. You can rub it a bit on the outside or on the rim of the glass that just adds a bit of flavor and then you can just drop it in. And there it is, one of the best cocktails in the world. This is a Boulevardier. Cheers. <laughs> 